Welcome back to another Sebastian story. We're back at it again, telling this sweet boy story. Of course, he's our Canicorso Italiano, and our sweet little Luna Petunia here. She's growing up, doing great, and she's also part Connie Corso and Great Dane. And we are just so excited. We're back to the holidays. It's Luna's first Christmas at home. Uh, so Merry Christmas to everybody, or Happy Holidays. Uh, just happiness in general. We hope everyone out there is doing great, and we really can't thank you all enough for such a wonderful year with Sebastian's story and the support we're getting with telling these stories. Uh, we've reached a lot of people, and we're having a lot of fun, and we're uh, really helping people, and. Uh, make it a difference and just trying to spread the love share the love share uh, all the wonderful things that these pappies come with and uh, We're just having such a great time with it We really appreciate all the love and support we're getting from all of our viewers and of course we just finished our pappy physical therapy He's been uh, working it out doing his thing doing great. He's uh, always doing wonderfully uh, just keeping paws strong and uh, just making sure he can live with that injury as best as he can and our sweet little honey Luna is just growing up like a weed. These two are just having lots of fun all day every day together. It is really uh, a huge responsibility actually to keep these two going all day every day. Uh, but of course we've got uh, friends for them to go play with. We've got uh, our friend with uh, uh, an electric dirt bike. Sebastian loves running with that and it was actually Luna's first time checking that out and she uh, fell right in line and realized, oh hey, this is a cool game. We can, I can get on board with this. Mr. Puppykins, he's my good boy. Yeah, Sebastian is just growing up so well. I mean, he's basically three and a half years old now. He's just about done with his puppy phase. He's a big sweet boy we expected him to be and uh, we just we, we couldn't we couldn't have hoped for better with him he he really had such a hard time when he first came in it literally took me a full year to get him to stop strangling himself on the other end of the leash when I'd go and walk him to go get the mail and him think that I'm not gonna hit him <laughs> with the mail he really had a hard life before he came to us and he has just grown and blossomed in such wonderful ways, and now he's just a big loving guy that just wants everybody else's approval, and it's perfect. We, we couldn't have hoped for more with him. He's just a big, sweet boy that just wants a lot of love, and sweet little Luna, who is sleeping quite comfortably in the back right now, she found out what love is, you know. She thankfully never had to suffer like he did, and we're just, uh, we're just making sure all these puppies get to have a good life and a good home, and that's what Sebastian's story is all about. And we're really looking forward to uh, 2022 of our uh, next full year of telling these stories and all the more pappies that will be coming into us, coming into our home and our hearts. And we just love them all. We couldn't have hoped for more. And although Luna's sleeping right now, we are just overjoyed with how well she has uh, grown into our lives, into our home, into our hearts. Uh, she is just such a spectacular little honey girl. We just, I, I call her my little honey. That's, uh, that's her nickname. I've got Pappy and I've got my little honey. Um, she is just the sweetest thing. Uh, definitely has uh, a good bit of tenacity. She has uh, quite of that, uh, she's an alpha female through and through. No question about it. Um, although it's funny that uh, despite that, she is very shy to the point of being afraid of new people. Uh, it really takes her time to warm up, whereas Sebastian just wants to jump right in everybody's arms, Luna really needs to feel you out and figure out what your what your deal is first, so I know, you're a sweet boy, you just want everybody to love you, you're a good boy, Sebastian, um, but yeah, we just can't wait to see how well Luna keeps doing, and she'll be one year, one year old next year, and um, yeah, and she'll eventually be a, a big sister herself, just like Sebastian's a big brother now to her, and we love it. We're just taking care of these pappies and save and rescue as many as we can and give them all the good lives that they deserve. That's Sebastian's story, and uh, thank you so much for your support. I hope everyone has a wonderful weekend, happy holidays, Merry Christmas, all of it. Just spread the love and joy and take care of your pappies, and, and they'll take care of you. Thank you all. As always, thank you so very much for watching. We're having a great time telling these stories, and we'll be back again soon with more. Thanks again.